I have instructed the criminal justice actors to execute their mandate without delay, holding perpetrators of femicide fully accountable. Gender desks in police stations must be enhanced, and we will introduce similar gender desks services in hospitals to ensure victims receive immediate attention and care. At the same time, we must equip our young people with the skills and awareness to navigate the risks they face in society. Social media has become a dangerous avenue for exploitation, and I urge our young people to treat strangers on these platforms with utmost caution. Our communities need education on the signs and causes of abuse and the resources available to victims. Awareness is a crucial step in prevention. We must increase awareness on the availability of safe spaces where victims can seek refuge, toll-free hotlines such as GBV 1195, Child Help 116, and the DCI anonymous reporting number 0800722203, and the counseling services in order to provide victims with the support they need to find protection. And we are committing Kenya Shillings 100 million for the Safe Home, Safe Spaces campaign and for the next 16 days of activism. And these women leaders will lead the way in making sure, in making sure that our girls, our women, are made aware of the dangers they face, especially when they engage with strangers, when they engage with people in uh, social media, in strange places, with strangers, it endangers their lives and it weakens their ability to be able to extricate themselves.